The hockey gods do indeed move in mysterious ways. Tonight in Nashville, the San Jose Sharks are in town to take on the Predators. It'll be the first game for Mike Santarelli and Cody Franson since they were traded from Toronto. To say the least, for these two kids born and raised in BC, this has been a long, strange trip. For Santarelli, it began over 10 years ago when he was drafted by Nashville in the sixth round, 178th overall. In all, he played just 32 games for the Preds before they traded him to Florida. Then there was a stop in Winnipeg, a year in Vancouver. And last summer, he signed a one-year deal with the Leafs. Now here's where the hockey gods really go to work. Both Santarelli and Franzen have gone from the depth and despair of playing for the Leafs to suddenly having a shot at winning the Stanley Cup. Truth is, these kinds of trade deadline miracles happen pretty much every year. It's Ray Bork going to Colorado. It's the New York Honor stealing Butch Goring out of L.A. And last year, it was Marion Gabrick landing in L.A. But what makes the Santa Rosa story a little special is all the adversity that he's been able to overcome. His journey had stops in Milwaukee, San Antonio, and Ting Rids, Sweden, wherever the hell that is. He's undergone surgery to his shoulder, not once, but twice. He's been traded three times, and after he was released by the Jets, Santarelli did not even know if he had a future in the NHL. And yet, through it all, he never let go of his dream. In that respect, his story is so similar to that of Willie Mitchell. In 2010, Mitchell suffered a severe concussion, and as a result, that summer, when he became an unrestricted free agent, the Canucks passed on him. Instead, Mitchell signed with the LA Kings and then went on to win two, count them, two Stanley Cups. That would be the same Vancouver Canucks who also passed on re-signing Santorelli. So now the question is, just what it mean to him to finally get his hands on the Stanley Cup and then bring it back home to Vancouver? Because like it or not, Canuck fans, now that Santorelli is in Nashville, that is a very real possibility. Think of it as uh, Cinderella meets dodgeball. Who knows, before it's over, the hockey gods may even turn this whole thing into a movie. Hmm. Oscars. Sunday. wonder what Bradley Cooper's doing.